Question number 11. Should I keep Sunday in honor of Christ's resurrection? Well, once again, friends, I told you, that sounds really nice, but there's no scripture to do that, that tells us to do that. You know what I think is really peculiar? Now, when I first learned the Sabbath truth, I was upset. I went to church on Sunday. I used to go to church on Sunday like a lot of you and some of you who are viewing right now. First thing I did, I did not want to go to church on the seventh day because I was already different enough that I don't want to be that peculiar. And I went to some of my friends that were Sunday ministers and I said, why do we go to church on Sunday? Give me some, some evidence. I didn't want to believe it. One pastor, I went to about five or six pastors. I got seven or eight different answers. One of them said, we, we keep Sunday in honor of the resurrection. I said, okay, where's the scripture? He said, well, there is no scripture, but we have a long-standing tradition. Then I remember what Jesus said, you set aside the commandment of God in order to observe your tradition. I went to another minister. He said, we're not under the law anymore. We're under grace. I said, does that mean that we're supposed to break the Ten Commandments? He said, no, we're supposed to keep nine of them. I said, so the one commandment we're supposed to break is the one that begins with the word remember? That didn't set very well. Then I went to another minister. He was very creative. He said, back in the days of Joshua, the sun stood still. Saturday turned into Sunday. <laughs> I said, oh, that's clever. I said, then why did Jesus still do it on the seventh day and everyone after that time? And you know what, friends? Little by little, I had to ask myself a very sobering question. Am I going to follow Jesus and be a real Christian or am I going to follow what's popular? Am I going to follow the world and its traditions or am I going to follow God's word? Very few real Bible Christians in the world today that say no matter what everyone does, even in my denomination, I don't follow what's popular. I want to follow what the Bible says because I will answer to God someday, not the pastor. And God's word is very clear and the Sabbath is one of his commandments. Question number 12. Well, if Sunday keeping isn't in the Bible, whose idea was it anyway? 